Hey, I'm Terry Klein from Austin, Texas. It's a pleasure to be here at world famous Fuller's Guitar in Houston, Texas. Uh, I am uh, on the verge of releasing my second record, uh, which is called Tex, and will be out on January 25th. This song is called Anika, and I wrote it for the first, uh, the first girl who ever broke my heart. We were six years old, and, uh, and she kissed me straight on the lips after we were cleaning up a game of Connect Four in our first grade classroom. And then for years afterwards, she denied that she'd done it. So. Her, I wrote this for everybody who's ever broken my heart. Her curse is that she has the coolest name. If I had a wooden leg, you'd steal it and leave me stuck up in a hayloft all alone. If I were Heathcliff, you'd forsake me and then haunt me as a ghost when you were gone. Well, I must have had it coming. I can't for sure say how. It's strange I have this stubborn wish. You were right here with me now. And I have fault lines etched across my heart like the cracked up perfect patchwork of the Mona Lisa and the deepest cut of all belongs to you yes it all began with you a sweet Anika oh, a sweet Anika If I were Jake, you'd be Lady Brett. Your ways would leave me desperate and beguiled. If I were Earth, you'd be the temptress moon, sending light across a quarter million miles. I guess I fall in love too easy and I move on. But some broken things just stay broke, yeah, that's the way it goes. I have fault lines attached across my heart, the cracked up perfect patchwork of the Mona Lisa. And the deepest cut of all belongs to you, yes, it all began with you. Sweet Anika Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> <laughs> that was, was nice. For, uh, for 15 years in Boston um, and, uh, and decided to leave that behind to do this because this really just, ever since I really wrote my first song, I felt like this is kind of what I'm meant to, meant do. to do. That's very cool. Yeah, yeah, and I'm very lucky to have a very supportive family and understanding that you know we would move 2,000 miles from Boston to Austin. Um, and I would give up this pretty lucrative job to do this, which is not lucrative. No. <laughs> All right, so this is Oklahoma. I buy a six pack of beer east of Chicota. 
at a truck stop and I get back on to the road. I drink one after the next and I admire that prairie sunset and I hope by 40 carries me back home. Well, my sister said the dad could use a visit. I said I don't know what good that would do. See, I've been drinking and depressed and kind of useless. She said it might not be a bad thing for you to. So I'm driving across Oklahoma, doing all I can to stay in my own lane. I should have turned around back in Arkansas, but I got my mother's blood in my veins. cold sweat west of Okima. I wish my racing heart would just give it a rest. I think of pulling off and picking up a half pint to smear off, but I hear my mother's sweet voice in my head. She said I need you to try and be there. I know it's hard for you, just do the best you can. But she was gone just a few short hours later. And Dad refused to let go of her hand. So I'm driving across Oklahoma, doing all I can to stay in my own. turned around back in Arkansas, but I got my mother's blood in my veins. It'll be my first time at the house since the reception. I've been saying it's tough for me to get away. But now facing down the dear departed memories. And my daddy's grief might be more than I can take. But I'm driving across Oklahoma. Doing all I can to stay in my own. turned around back in Arkansas, but I got my mother's blood in my Got me, Terry. <laughs> That's a good one. Yeah. Thank you. Well, they took out the circle, but the traffic's no better. Sixty million dollars just pissed away. You sit for an hour, the baby fills her diaper. That huggy ain't leaking. It's 
So I guess we're okay. And at Freddy's in Brewster, roast beef and salami, sliced to perfection, that IBP meat. Folks stand there waiting, and tunics and tevas, a little hungover, maybe one third asleep. On a thin strip of sand out in the Atlantic, you can sin like the Kennedys did. 